Hello everyone and welcome to Life in Gear Hacks. Today I'll be reviewing the secret twin wallet in vintage black as you can see right here. Uh, something I bought recently, lovely wallet, really nice finish on that. I'll be showing you basically the layout of the wallet, the design, functionality and I'll also be showing you how I'm moving from this very traditional and thick wallet which is empty now but this very traditional wallet to a more slimline system consisting of the secret twin wallet as well as a small money clip as you can see there. Just to let you know, I carry a lot of stuff in my wallet. I have cash, I have my cards, store cards, emergency contact numbers, business cards, receipts, a bunch of other things. And as I'm sure you know, the bigger our wallets are, the more tendency we have to just stuff more and more things in there. You know, you can see I have various pockets there. There was an ID pouch. This is, this is a great wallet. This has lasted me a good few years. I got this as a present and, and it's really lasted me a long time. But lo and behold, I thought, you know, it's time to move on. It's time to move to a slimline system, something a bit unique, something modern. What I really liked is that what the secret offers is, as you can see there, this great contraption. I have here two card holders and you can just very easily pop the cards out just like that so there are two and fans the cards out very well and these cases are also rfid blocking so for a lot of you out there who are conscious of new technologies where card details can be skimmed etc this is a great little feature i saw this retailing for something between 60 to 90 pounds really depending on where you're buying this uh, I managed to find this here for the equivalent of about £90, but I'm sure you can pick this up for much cheaper. Let's go through the wallet. Just to show you here, there is a very nice clasp here. It opens up very nicely, as you can see. I've just got some money here. Let's just empty this out first of all, and then I can show you what, what I have. Um, so, opening up, you can see there's this small flap here that you can use to put money and a few other cards or whatever else you have. Uh, I've done so there. There are two separate flaps just here that can hold about, they say about two or three cards. I've just got my hospital patient cards in there and some loyalty cards. And that's essentially it inside. You know, just a very slim line, compact system. All the good stuff in this really are in these card case holders, as you can see and uh, it has a great feature where you just pop this button and they just fan out all the cards will fan out very nicely so you can see all my store cards there so I don't need to go into the details uh, but if I pull that out I can just show you the contraption itself I don't know if you can see in there very well but there is a small contraption that allows those cards to fan out very nice feature lovely feature actually very slim line However, unfortunately, you can't carry large amounts of cash in this. So what I've opted for is just a separate money clip. And this is a great clip that I got from a company called Labrador here in Thailand. And it's essentially just a magnetic money clip you can see there. And it has one space for a card in there. So all I keep is my money and my bank card, essentially just an ATM cash card. So whenever I need money, I'm using that. And that's my everyday cash money clip and then I just keep some spare cash in the secret wallet because as I mentioned earlier there's not a great deal of money you can actually keep in this wallet so this is just my backup emergency money really so most of the time I'm, I'm using a money clip to deal with everyday cash unfortunately it's not a heavy cashless society here and the secret wallets were designed in the Netherlands where there are a large number of card transactions happening every day so it's very convenient for people living there unfortunately if you're living in a country where cash is still very widely used as I do then the wallet itself I would say is probably not enough that's why I decided to get the twin wallet here with two cases this is also available with just the one case and either with the clasp or without. But this is the one I preferred that worked for me in terms of my lifestyle. 
and everything that I need to carry with me. So there you go folks, that's it. That's me moving from my very traditional thick leather wallet lovely wallet that has served me very well throughout the years and moving on to this new slim system consisting of the secret twin wallet in black leather vintage and this labrador money clip excellent choice if you're thinking about changing your wallet moving to a more slimline system i would highly recommend something along these lines you know wallets are really changing these days before buying this i had a look at many wallets and there are many out there so there there's plenty to look for so take your time find something that works for you this combination really worked for me very well and i'm enjoying it right now and it's such a joy using the secret wallet every time when I go and just pop out these cards whenever I need to use them. And if you want to pick a different card, you can just move some of them out of the way and take the one that you want, or just pop them all back in. Great system. And as you can see, doesn't fall out, very secure, sits very well there. I saw a lot of reviews for this wallet online. Uh, however, the only one I found was the slimline or the single case wallet. It, there were not many videos on this twin wallet, so this is the one that I really liked. It took me a while to decide to get this. I had to think a lot, but in the end, I managed to find the store that sell, sells this here and actually went to the store, looked around, tried it out, took everything out from my own wallet, placed it in here, tried out both combinations of wallets, the slimline and the twin wallet and in the end this is the one that worked for me so there you go folks thank you very much and if you want more videos just go ahead and hit that subscribe button and as always if you like my videos don't forget to share like or comment and remember kids keep making smart life choices